Hi today you will learn fun facts about snowflakes even as a child many noticed that it is impossible to find two identical snowflakes during a snowfall. They are unique and there is no pattern in how they take shape. Many scientists devote many years of their lives to study this issue and even learned how to create snowflakes in a laboratory using modern technologies. Everyone is used to the fact that snowflakes are white. But in history there are cases when colored snow fell from the sky. Also in some areas of the Arctic you can find pink and even red snow. The reason for this is the growing algae and microorganisms that live in this area. Some settlements use phrases to describe snow. For example, the Eskimos say 24 words. The Sami tribes designated snow using 41 words. Hearing how the snow creaks, you can immediately say that it is the crystals of snowflakes breaking under pressure. The sound can be of different heights. It depends on the ambient temperature. The higher the temperature, the more sonorous the sound will be. About 40% of the world's population have never seen snow in their life. Snowflakes are always symmetrical in structure. They are composed of ice crystals. In order to reproduce the crunch of snow, when sounding films, people squeezed sugar and salt which they mixed together in advance. Scientists have divided the shapes of snowflakes into classes the main of which are a needle, a star an irregular crystal and a column. So science knows about 5,000 forms of snowflakes. In Japan a snowflake museum was built in honor of Nakayu Kachiro, a scientist who dedicated his life to the study of snowflakes. Scientists have concluded that the most complex snowflakes fall in places where the climate is very harsh and cold. This feature is not different for snowflakes that have fallen in mild climates. The largest snowflake was 38 centimeters in diameter. Such a find was found in Fort Coy during heavy snowfall in 1987. The average diameter of snowflakes is considered to be up to 7 millimeters. In 1951, the International Commission on Snow and Ice adopted a worldwide classification of snowflakes. The birth of a snowflake begins with a tiny core. It can be dust or a piece of ice from a cloud. When water vapor condenses around the core, a snowflake is formed. 350 million snowflakes. It is this amount that can be counted in one cubic meter of snowfall. Each snowflake is unique. No two snowflakes are alike. This phenomenon is considered an unsolved mystery of nature. In order to study the structure of snowflakes make from photography, so that the snowflakes are clearly visible in the photo they are illuminated with special lamps, so they are colored, and still become functional as complex lenses. Such data are needed to understand the crystal structure of snowflakes. In conditions of very low temperatures which occur in the far north the snow becomes very hard. Even if you try to hit the snow with a torus you can hear a sound characteristic of the ringing of iron which was hit by an axe. The average weight among snowflakes is about 1 milligram. Snowflakes are the most amazing example of how the most complex can be created from the simplest. Scientists have proven that you can eat clean snow, but it does not bring any benefit to the body. It is also not high in calories, and in order for it to be digested by the body it needs to expend a large amount of energy. Snowflakes fall to earth at a speed of about one kilometer per hour. If the information was useful to you, you can like and subscribe to the channel. See you soon.